Super flares are some of the most brilliant pyrotechnic displays in the galaxy. They are massive bursts of energy ejected from the surface of a star. Why stars eject these huge bursts of energy still puzzle scientists. Astronomers previously thought these explosions occurred mostly on stars that, unlike our Sun, were young and active. But a 2019 study suggests super flares can also occur on older, quieter stars like the Sun. However, once in a millennium, Normal size flares are common on the Sun, but scientists say there is some possibility that we could experience super flares in the next 100 years or so. The reason why young stars are more active is that they rotate much faster, and that's why they generate more powerful flares. The same happened with the Sun when it was much younger, but scientists are puzzled to find out that large flares can occur on the modern Sun. If a super flare erupted from the Sun, Earth would likely sit in the path of a wave of high-energy radiation. Such a blast could disrupt electronics across the globe, causing widespread blackouts and shorting out communication satellites in orbit. To make the new discovery, astronomers observed data from the European Space Agency's Gaia spacecraft and from the Apache Point Observatory in New Mexico. Over a series of studies, the group used those instruments to narrow down a list of super flares that had come from 43 stars that resembled our Sun. The researchers then subjected those rare events to a rigorous statistical analysis. From quantifications, scientists found that younger stars tend to produce the most super flares, generating them once in a week. If a super flare occurred about a thousand years ago, it wouldn't have been a problem. People would have probably seen a large aurora and that's it. But now, with all our electronics, it would be a much bigger problem. So, the results of this study should definitely be a wake-up call for life on our planet. The researchers published their results in 2019 in the Astrophysical Journal.